Hey guys, today we're going to be taking a look at the travel collection from Wool and Prints, which is a collaboration that they've done with Pack Hacker that is a really popular YouTube channel and blog that provides some great reviews and guides for different travel gear and everyday carry gear. And you know, they've been a big inspiration for me and like the collaboration that we saw a few weeks ago between Pact and Chase Reeves, I was very excited to see what Pack Hacker would bring to the design process with Woolen Prints. And I've been testing out the travel collection for the past few months. And so far it's been a really great experience. The travel collection consists of some really nice merino accessories. So there's a hoodie, a t-shirt, and then they also have a really interesting neck tube. And all these accessories have the comfort and durability that you would expect from merino from Woolen Prints, but they also have some nice kind of travel specific touches that make them just a little bit more versatile. So I'm excited to share them with you guys. And I want to thank the company for sending the items for me to test out. With all that being said, let's go ahead and jump in. And so to kick things off, the first thing that I wanted to do was take a look at the travel collection as a whole, as there is quite a bit of overlap in some of the features that we're going to be taking a look at in the individual pieces. So again, as I mentioned in the intro, the travel collection consists of a neck tube, a t-shirt, and a hoodie. And each of these items is made out of merino wool. And so that really gets to the heart of the idea behind this travel collection, which is to provide you know, versatile items that will be durable and comfortable and allow you to travel with less. And that's really something that Merino is great for as Merino wool has properties that naturally make it a great travel clothing item. So it's you know, fairly wrinkle resistant, it's temperature regulating, so you can wear it in hotter or colder climates. It also battles odor pretty well and so it's just a really nice and versatile material you'll see this used in a lot of popular travel clothing brands and i particularly like how woolen prints does their merino items and i'm imagining that this is why pack hacker wanted to work with them we've tested out a few of woolen prints shirts in the past and one of the best things about their merino items is that they blend it with a nylon and spandex that makes it not only you know really versatile for travel but just very soft stretchy and comfortable much more comfortable than some of the other merino clothing that i've tried out and that's really strongly shown here with the t-shirt the neck tube and the hoodie these items feel very comfortable definitely something i could wear all day or during a long trip and feel very comfortable staying in and then in addition to that a good thing about the partnership with pack hacker is the fact that they've also included just some nice little touches that you know you wouldn't really think about that much but when you're traveling for a long time and constantly using these items it really starts to get very useful so one of the things that you'll find on all the items is these little loops at the top so that you can hang this up if you're going to the gym or maybe you're at the beach or the pool and you just want to hang the shirt up or your hoodie when you're not wearing them i absolutely love this this is something that i hadn't really thought about before but it's so much better than kind of draping this over a chair or possibly having it fall on the ground and get dirty and then the hook itself has that nice kind of aqua color that's you know consistent with pack hackers brand and it feels really sturdy like it's not going to tear even as it's holding something larger like this hoodie and then in addition to the loops another nice thing that you'll find in all of the items is that they have some hidden pockets that are going to be great to just you know allow you to tuck in something like some cash or a credit card so on the neck tube you have this little pocket at the top it's probably the smallest of the bunch it doesn't have a zipper or anything like that but this is going to be a great spot to maybe put some cash or maybe an id or just some documents and then you'll find similar pockets on the shirt on the side you have a really nice zipper pocket here down towards the bottom i love the use of this i've never seen this in a shirt it's pretty well hidden so it's not something that'll be immediately obvious for something like a pickpocket and then it has plenty of space again for some cash or maybe a key while you're running or walking around you can put an id in here so love the versatility added here and then in addition to those little touches a really nice thing about each of these items particularly the shirt and the hoodie is that you can actually roll these up very easily to make them super packable and so in addition to being able to roll them up they also have kind of this additional area at the top where you can tuck each of the ends of the shirt or the hoodie in so that it stays folded and just keeps it really small and tight so that you can pack it and avoid everything getting super wrinkled. Diving into the individual items, the first one here is the travel tee. And I've been a big fan of this shirt. I love that it's just a simple and solid t-shirt that matches up well with a ton of different outfits. I've worn this with jeans, chinos, 
just a pair of shorts and it's looked great with anything that I've worn it with. And I really like the color combinations that are offered. The one that I have here is kind of a heathered gray, but it also comes in an all black. So just some really simple colors that are gonna be very easy to travel with because they match up with so much stuff. And then as far as the sizing, I found that the shirt is very true to size. I ordered this in a medium, which is what I would normally use. And it's been very comfortable to wear. And because of the nylon and spandex materials that I mentioned a little bit earlier, it has a nice amount of stretch that's made it great regardless of whatever activity I've been using. And then again, because of the merino fabrics used here, it's really worked very well, particularly in the hot summer months that I've been testing this during. It's been able to handle all the times that I've gotten really sweaty and just had to be outside in the humidity. I've been able to wear this many days in a row without having to rewash it and it hasn't really begun to stink too badly. So just a really nice addition there. And then when you do have to wash it, it's very easy to just throw into a machine wash and then you can air dry it. And so just really low maintenance and overall it's just been a fantastic simple t-shirt to add to my travel wardrobe. Next up is the travel hoodie. And a hoodie is a really fantastic item to take with you, particularly when you're traveling by plane or bus or train. You know, whenever the air conditioning is really high, it's always nice to have that extra bit of warmth and comfort that a hoodie provides. And this one here has done a fantastic job in the comfort department. It's felt great for just keeping me really comfortable. In my case, when I've been working from home, I haven't been doing as much traveling, but I do like to crank the AC up. So I've been able to test this out in that environment and it's kept me very, very warm and comfortable. And I really love the materials used here. It also has a Merino blend, but it has this French terry cloth that just feels fantastic against the skin. And then it also has the same sort of elasticity that we saw in the t-shirt. So it really just moves with me regardless of what I've been doing. And when you're traveling, you kind of just kind of have to find the best way to be comfortable when sitting in a seat for a long period of time. This is a fantastic addition. And so the hoodie itself, in addition to keeping you warm, just has a really nice, simple look. I love that the minimalism lens has been placed on this to the extreme almost. You know, we've tested out items like the Bobex Travel Sweatshirt 2.0, which I really like. It comes with a ton of different features. And so this is kind of a completely different approach in the sense that it doesn't have too many extra pockets or features. It doesn't have a pillow or you know a pen on the zipper pull, but the things that it does offer are really, really well implemented. So in addition to the comfort, you know, you have just very high quality materials. You have a YKK zipper on the front. I really like this locking zipper that it has here. It really just stays in place. It doesn't kind of sneak down while you're wearing it. So you really have to pull this up to be able to loosen this. And then I love at the top, the little touches you have this kind of covering over the zipper here. So when you pull this all the way up, it doesn't hit your chin uncomfortably. And then on top of that, you just have a few pockets on the front that are really nice for placing your hands into and then on the inside of these pockets they have zippers to allow you to close them up so that you can store something in here and just have a little bit of additional security so again some nice ykk zippers here as well and then on the inside of these compartments you have an extra kind of hidden area where you can toss in maybe a card or some money similar to what we saw on the neck tube you can just kind of sneak it in it's just a very small sleeve here it doesn't have a ton of space, but again, it's just for those little essentials that you wanna keep a little bit more hidden while you're walking around throughout the day or traveling. And then just kind of wrapping up on the materials, in addition to all the comfort and durability offered by the Merino and Nylon Blend, you also have some nylon reinforcing on the sleeves. You can kind of see this different material here and then on the hood as well to add just that extra bit of durability in these areas that might experience a little bit more wear. And then opening this up, Taking a closer look at the inside, you can get a better feel for this material here. It looks super soft. It's been very comfortable to wear. And then besides that, it's very simple. There's no sort of internal pockets here, just the ones that you saw on the outside. And then at the top, as we mentioned earlier, you have the hook to hang this up. And then you can also see the Woolen Prince and Pack Hacker logos. I like that there's no tags on any of these items, so they feel really comfortable. And then you have some washing instructions. So very easy to care for, really durable. And then a really nice thing about this, like the shirt, is you can actually roll this up into itself to make it very easy to pack down small and toss into a travel bag. 
And then the last item that we're gonna be taking a look at is the neck tube. And this is an interesting one. It's not something that I've normally traveled with a lot in the past, but I know Pack Hacker really likes this type of item. They featured similar items in a lot of their videos. And after using this for a bit, I can see why, as it's a very light and small item that's really easy to just wear or toss into a bag. It doesn't take up a lot of space and it actually has a good amount of functionality. So this is pretty large, so it can kind of take a second to get over your head. It's a little bit long, but you can wear this around your neck to kind of help keep your neck warm if you're in a colder climate. And then you can also just kind of toss this over your eyes to use as a sleep mask while you're traveling so you can avoid taking an additional item. I know on some of Pack Hacker's videos, I have seen them use things like this as kind of a headband or even a beanie when you're in a colder climate. And if you're in a pinch, you might even be able to pull this up over your face to use this as a mask. Nowadays, it's so important to have a mask. And I won't say that this is as effective as a mask. I'm not a doctor or anything like that. But in a pinch, if you want to just be able to cover your face and add some sort of barrier, this could kind of work in that instance. And besides that, it's just a really comfortable and it could be an even stylish item to wear when you're in a colder climate. And as we start to get more into the winter season, I feel like I'll be using this more and just kind of pairing it with the hoodie or with other jackets that I have. And it's just gonna be a nice thing that I can toss into my bag going forward that I know isn't gonna take up a lot of weight or space. And so to wrap up, it's been a really great experience testing out the travel collection over the past couple of months. Each of the items has been very comfortable to wear. They feel very well built. And I really like all the kind of additional touches that help make them more versatile for travel. And so you can currently purchase the collection on Woolen Prince's site starting at about $44 for the neck tube and then going up to $230 for the hoodie. And you can also combine the items in a few different ways to help save some money. And so the pricing on these is definitely a bit of an investment, which is normally going to be the case with really solid merino clothing. But if you're looking for reliable items that are going to help you reduce the amount of things that you have to travel with and you have a little bit of a higher budget, then they may be worth the additional cost. And so if you're interested in other items like these to help build out a more versatile and minimal travel wardrobe, I definitely recommend you check out some of the roundup videos that I've done covering my favorite travel shirts and travel pants. And I also recommend taking a look at some of the in-depth videos that I've done for items such as the Amazon Essentials Puffer Jacket, the Bobax Travel Sweatshirt 2.0, and the Lems Chuckaboo. And if there are any similar items that you think I should feature on the channel, as always, please let me know in the comments. And I want to thank the company again for sending the travel collection for me to test out. And if you guys found this video helpful, please give us a like. And if you haven't already, please go ahead and subscribe so you don't miss any upcoming videos. And we'll see you in the next one. Mm -hmm.